So that's actually the Nessat. Look at that. Yeah. No, that's that's Good his stuff. intention. I'm pretty sure. It's his Good intention. Stuff. Uh, so yeah, we're going to Smashville. What do you, what's your thoughts on the stage? I think this is a. Uh, Probably in, in Ness's favor, but Mario don't, doesn't really have a bad stage. I hate this stage, so well, we'll, I know we'll leave it at that. <laughs> yeah. See, uh, Ooh, that okay. platform's going to be really good for Ness, especially for mixing up recoveries and also getting the, the forward throw if he can somehow do that. Yeah, it's definitely pretty sweet. Get uh, some cheese. But overall, this matchup actually has a lot of... Uh, a lot of factors. A lot of factors. That People fireball can really gimp him. People say uh, Mario won this. I can see that. Um, uh, you get the cape off stage. Yeah, cape off stage. It's reverse. Either, Either A, the projectile, or him moving. Exactly. Ooh. Oh, he reads the roll inside and just gets the bat right in his face. Right. That is the Dunsies. bat. I'm so glad you were there. I was thinking about like that. So and so, on the other yeah. end, though, you have Ness that has just incredible moves, incredible priority. Definitely. Uh, definitely super strong. Uh, Coco, a player that's very read-based. Yes. Uh, he, 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 he literally prides himself on claiming that he can read anybody's roll. Yeah, I can see that, but the thing is, when you're playing against one of the best in, uh, in Utah, like the best in Utah, they're not going to be rolling that much. I don't think he's going to be choosing the dumb option, so I, I think it's going to be hard for uh, Coco to really capitalize on those hard reads when he's going to be mixing it up I, as I much as he does. Yeah, definitely see that. Because uh, best Ness is no slouch. And right here, you're, you're seeing a lot of this trouble. Uh, Coco right now is just trying to approach... Oh, that was oh, that actually was really super nice. nice. Yeah, wow, I did not... Uh, oh. oh, he's got no jump? Okay, gets oh, a nair. really good, that nair. There's gets no way he's coming back. No. no way. Done. And right now, Coco, although behind quite a bit of percent, definitely in a position to come back from this. Yeah, I mean, Mario gets a down throw, or even actually against floaties, he gets a forward throw to a raw back air, or I guess an up throw to uh, down air. Yeah, so Coco actually at 0%, I believe it's 0 only, uh, really likes doing up throw uh, up air or down air. Okay. He, uh, he, he believes there's a lot of follow-ups after it. Sometimes you can get fair or up air off. Okay. Yeah, I do know that uh, my roommate, TSS, was... Uh, Messing with Mario a little bit, and he was doing forward throw to raw back air, and then followed up with either a re grab or something else like that. Yeah, definitely. But Ooh, yeah, you you possibilities. You're Mario. Everything, everything. But he's Ness, and uh, and Ness has the back throw. It throws you places. You, you you go places when you play Ness. Ooh. Oh. What happened? It's a grammatical error. Wait. It's best. You're not the best. The best Ness. It's not best Ness. It's the best. Shout out to Best Ness noticing that while he's playing. <laughs> like, like when I'm up there, there like, wait, hey, that ain't me. That ain't me. When I'm playing up there, I'm just, I'm just looking at the screen. I'm not looking at, I'm not looking at the, at the no. projector. No, not at all. Oh, he's got, he pulls up his pocket Luigi, which I think is even better in this matchup. No, no, no. This matchup is actually insanely good. Uh, yeah. And and I was actually talking to Coco before this. He said, Ooh. I'm gonna pull out Luigi uh, if if I lose game one. Makes sense. I, I don't even really think that was Mario holding him back. I think it was just kind of sloppy play, honestly. I can agree with that. Like I said, he's someone who, who wants to get those reads, mm -hmm. but he needs a better neutral game. I agree. Gets, I agree. Oh, he needs to be able to apply pressure. Oh, I, I I really wanted the down B off stage. You know what? I respect it. I feel like he he wasn't ready for it. Yeah. He he, he actually was uh, expecting that fireball to miss. So I think uh, I think that's what happened. There. Okay. Oh, but right now this is pretty close. Definitely both players in a position to get a kill here. Yeah, the scary thing about Luigi is he can literally kill you at any percent that he wants to. Oh, okay, we live in. Wow. Surprised, actually. Oh. Nice. I like that. I like that fair in there. Yeah, I, I really like that. Ooh. Oh, but he slides you away. He not be doing away that. Forward smash. Oh, that's one thing about Luigi is you get hit on shield, you are sliding, son. Yeah. You will go to slide. And oh, and he gets a misfire. Win. That's probably an unfortunate misfire in this case because he gave the stage control. Yeah, and um, and one thing that uh, I don't know, I like to see Coco do is make. Mm. I don't understand why he's throwing out this. Uh, I think that time he wanted the misfire. Okay. Which, which you know I don't. I Sometimes don't. when you get the misfire, it happens again. Like more often than not. Oh, Luigi's in a bad spot no, here. This, this is this is it right here. He has no jump. Oh, he That's does have a jump. No, okay. I was gonna say. I was like, oh, I don't I don't know if you're right about I, that. I am wrong. Or Steven. Yeah. But. So oh. we're looking here, and Coco's just getting very impatient. And this is the thing, Coco, Coco's yeah. going for these smash attacks when he just doesn't have to. Yeah. He's not, he's like, yes, he's losing, but you cannot be impatient to get the kill. That's the kill true. will come, whether you need a back air, nair them off stage, whatever yeah. it may be. The great thing about Luigi is you just keep getting those grabs, you keep getting that percent, and eventually your up air will kill, your back air, your 